Rachel Amber. She looks so hopeful and pretty. I wonder what happened to her. Okay, I better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. Hi, Miss Grant. Excuse me, Max. I know everybody loves being asked to sign a petition, but would you do Miss Grant a favor and hear me out? Sure, I always have time for you. What's the petition? David Matson, our chief of security, wants to put surveillance cameras all around the campus. Halls, classrooms, gym, dorm rooms, etc. Blackwell Academy should be a high school, not a high security penitentiary. That's crazy. I get why school should be on high alert these days, but cameras in the dorm rooms... It's a slippery slope, and it's up to you and your classmates to stand up here. Blackwell Academy has a noble heritage, from the Native Americans who founded this land to the pioneers who shared it in peace, not fear and violence. The Native Americans? The tribes who were here first who welcomed the settlers. Both cultures found a mutual symbiosis and thrived. Now, before I assign you homework with this lecture, will you please sign the petition to keep our campus from going back to 1984? Absolutely. I don't mind security, but not pure surveillance. I knew you were my favorite new student at Blackwell for a good reason. Hi, Brooke. Let me guess. You want to fly my drone? I'd love to. I love planes and balloons and... This is neither. Do you know what a drone really is? A weapon, right? Uh, you read too many conspiracy sites. This might be too complicated for you. Funny. Warren said you were smart. Please, step back. I don't want to go that way. Hey there, Stella. Hey, I know you. You're the new quiet girl in Jefferson's class. Isn't he incredible? I'm not sure yet. I mean, he's clearly a genius, but I don't agree with everything he says. He does get a bit pretentious, but he's passionate and just says what he thinks. If Victoria wasn't all over him, I would definitely make a move. Now that you mention it, he doesn't respond to Victoria's flirting. That means he has good taste. You have a lot to learn here at Blackwell. 
Rachel Amber absolutely had sex with him. Well, I heard that from a good source. Um, interesting. See, you learn something new every day at school. Like I said, you have a lot to learn. Max, see you in class. Yo, Justin. Check out the Max. Come to thrash? Oh yeah? Bring it. What's your first move gonna be? Uh... Jump? You're such a poser. If you can't even name a simple nose slide or a tray flip, you should walk on. Nope, I don't want to go there. I could go for a burger now. What's up, Daniel? Oh, hi, Max. Could I, um, ask you a question? Would you mind letting me sketch you? I do put my sketches on Facebook, though. I'd rather not, Daniel. Not that I don't want you to. Never mind. I guess you would be too ashamed. Now, I have to get back to my drawing. The petition is going well. I think we'll hit our goal. Hey, Hayden. There she is. The retro selfie master. That's me, all right. You look relaxed as usual, Hayden. It's a skill one cultivates at Blackwell. Especially when one represents the Vortex Club. Not to boast. Let's talk later, Hayden. Bye, Max. No, I have to get my chemical on and study. We should get you and Dana out one night. What's up, Daniel? Oh. I'd be honored, Daniel. Makes me feel like a muse. Funny you should say that. I was just thinking about my real muse. Rachel Amber. Okay. Why don't you start drawing me? Even though I must be a step down from Rachel. No way. You're a good substitute muse. Oh, that's a good posture. Good. Good. Best portrait ever. Thanks, Max. I'd like to draw you another time if you want.
This day has been so insane. Everything is happening too fast. And none of it makes any sense. These visions, this power. I keep expecting to wake up one more time. But if this is a dream, then I'm not asleep. Which means somehow I did rewind time. So there has to be a reason. And I have to find out why. What a complicated name for such a tiny drone. Hey, Hayden. First. That's me, all right. It's a skill. What the hell is the Vortex Club, anyway? It seems so elitist. Only if you're not cool enough to get in. And it doesn't hurt your resume. If you say so. I do. But you should actually come hang with us one night, then you wouldn't be so inclined to gossip. You mean hang with a Vortex Club? That sounds like a setup to a horrible prank. Chillax, paranoia girl. We're not that desperate for fun. We know how to do that on our own. It seems weird to think about partying with all those Rachel Amber posters up. You're high. Rachel used to hang out with us too. She was a blast. Smart, not bitchy like, you know. So you knew Rachel Amber? I knew she liked to party. <laughs> Fun to be around. Oh, yeah, and she was hot. Did Victoria like Rachel? She seems like the jealous type. Don't think you know Victoria so well. She respected Rachel, even if she didn't act like it. Rachel was actually a member of the Vortex Club? No. Rachel was like her own club. She was actually too cool for us. And I'll deny I ever said that. What do you think happened to her? Um, uh, whatever happens to people who disappear without a trace. Do you really want Nathan Prescott to represent? Oh, please. Nathan is like everybody's voodoo doll. Kill the rich kid. He's all right and a fun guy to hang with. Fuck the haters. He seems genuinely unstable to me. Nate has his extreme moments, but don't we all? I don't know yet, Hayden. Let's talk later, Hayden. I'm... Warren's waiting for me and his flash drive in the parking lot, so I better get back to my dorm. The petition is going well. I think we'll hit our goal. Hey, Evan. Mind if I check out your cool portfolio? Let's see if you're worthy of it, Max. You'll have to answer a simple question. Who photographed the famous falling soldier? 
Isn't it Robert Dorno? Oh my. You can't even tell the difference between street photography and photojournalism. No portfolio peak for you. Sorry, I have to get back to my portfolio. No time for amateurs. No offense, Max. Evan's portfolio always looks so uber pro. I'd love to see his photos in there. Come on, Logan, bring it, brah. Yeah! I need to go to my room and return Warren's flash drive. Howdy, Samuel. Well, hello there. What's up with these Rachel Amber posters? Well, only she would nice. know that, right? Uh, I guess. It just makes the campus look sad. You can't color over that sunlight. Sweet. What do you think happened to her? Best not to dwell on the past. Samuel looks forward, like a clock. You knew Rachel? How can you know a prison? You just stare in awe. Now I have to go paint windows. See you later, Samuel. And watch your step around here, Max. After I sweep, I paint. Oh. Hi, Max. Yeah. What are you reading? Love today or die forever. Don't even say anything. It's a bestseller. What to say? Good point. Now if you'll excuse me. No. Oh, look. It's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. What a lame gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wave hipster bullshit. The Daguerrean processor. You could barely even say that. I guess you got your meds filled. Okay. <laughs> Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. Two. Oh wait, hold that pose. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, why don't you go fuck your selfie? Oh yes, Victoria. I'll get your bony ass out of my way. Jill, Victoria, it's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look great. I can't even chill on the steps. No. 
Nice, bro. I need to figure this out. Sorry, no paparazzi allowed. This main sprinkler valve looks easy enough to use. This main sprinkler valve looks easy enough to use. See if this works. Nice. No way! No fucking you okay, way! Okay, Victoria. Oh, Sam, you're sorry. Wet, wet paint is not good for hair. No. Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo! Hold on, hold on. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. So move your ass before I dry. It worked. Don't mess with Max, bitches. Uh, hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? Don't. Don't say a word, Max. Oh, wait. Hold that pose. And no filter needed before I post this. Now please move. I've had a messed up day and I'm going to my room. You do that? I know where you live. So does Nathan. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Hurry, Courtney! Victoria is going to be pissed we took so long. Home sweet home, my favorite cocoon. <sighs> it feels so nice to just relax. This day has been so damn bizarre and it feels like it has gone on forever. Maybe I'll just wake up now and I need to grab a flash drive on my desk before I see Warren. I need 
need to grab a flash drive. I need to grab a flash drive on my desk before I see Warren. I look so pathetic. I am so addicted. Warren makes me laugh. It's nice to feel like I already made a real friend here. Philip Lorca de Corsha, my man. I don't think I could take my camera to those places. Look at that shot. I love Julia Cameron's Victorian vibe. Talk about analog cameras. Ah, oh, Dolly, what a fantastic eye. He could truly freeze time. Hard to believe I'm 18 now. I'm lucky my parents enabled my photo habit into adulthood. I need to grab the flash drive on my desk before I see Warren. Looks like Dana left me a little poke. Great. Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. You can't get out now, Dana. So tell me the truth or rot in there. Welcome to the real drama queens of Blackwell. Hey, Juliet. So Is everything cool? Oh, yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. You what did she do? What didn't she do? Dana's been sexting with my boyfriend. Ouch. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking you me? Out, you never talk. Me. Just zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? Juliet Pats... Juliet Patson. That was truly sad. Thanks for your concern, Max Caulfield. By the way, Juliet Watson. Hey, Juliet. Oh, yes, Max. Hey, I've watched... So stupid. Juliet Watson, you be nice. I'm flattered. I didn't even think you knew my name at all. Uh, of course I do. You are Thanks. Ridiculous. I locked Dana in because she was sexting Zach, my boyfriend. Unbelievable. Would if Dana do that? Out, According to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. According to Victoria? Huh. She saw the sext. And Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go. Straight to hell. Max! That's boom. This is the email I need to show Juliet. Now I have to print this fast and get the. Is she going to get a 3D printer for her dorm room? Maybe I will join her posse. Let's play a little photo Tetris and leave Victoria a message. Let's move this here. And this one there. Hmm, a pattern is emerging. Leave me alone, Max. Get a clue. No need to go there now. I'm not letting her out until she tells the truth. I should find a way to end this silly standoff.
Max and Chloe, best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. I, I am Lauren makes me laugh. It's nice to feel like I already made a real friend here. Leave me alone, Max. Get a clue. I'm not letting her out until she tells the truth. No reason to go now. 